Sons and Daughters of God, Daily Devotional by Alan G. White. We bear the fruits of brotherly love. October 13th. We abide in Christ the living vine. Herein is my Father glorified, that ye bear much fruit. So shall ye be my disciples. John chapter 15 verse 8. The union between Christ and his people is to be living, true, unfailing, resembling the union that exists between Father and Son. This union is the fruit of the indwelling of the Holy Spirit. All true children of God will reveal to the world their union with Christ and with their brethren. Those in whose hearts Christ abide will bear the fruit of brotherly love. They will realize that as members of God's family, they are pledged to cultivate, cherish and perpetuate Christian love and fellowship in spirit, word and action. To be children of God, members of the royal family, means more than many suppose. Those who are accounted by God as, ch as, as his children will reveal Christ-like love to one another. They will live and work for one object, the, the proper representation of Christ to the world. By their love and unity, they will show to the world that they bear the divine credentials by nobility by the nobility of love and self-denial they will show those around them that they are true followers of the Savior by this shall all men know that ye are my disciples if you have love one for another the most powerful evidence a man can give that he has been born again and is a new man in Christ Jesus is the manifestation of love for his brethren, the doing of Christ-like deeds. This is the most wonderful witness that can be born in favour of Christianity and will win souls to the truth. Christ brings all true believers into complete oneness with himself, even oneness which exists between him and his Father. The true children of God are bound up with one another and with their Saviour. They are one with Christ in God. This is your daily devotion. We thank you for listening. We hope you can join us again tomorrow. Please also check the YouTube comments for any further study notes. Sons and daughters of God.